Woof. Had to run down the stairs there. All this working from home. Time to uh, hit the gym, right? Well, hello again, people, and welcome to our Built Ford Tough Garage on Ford Auto Night SEMA Show Special. I'm down here in the basement to talk about trucks, right? But not just any old pickup. I'm talking about the Ford F-150. For decades, F-150 has been the tool people have counted on to get the job done. Well, Ford has done it again. The all-new 2021 F-150 is packed with new features, and it comes at exactly the right time. This is the most productive and most connected F-150 ever, and of course, it remains built Ford tough. It has the smarts and the capability our customers need and have come to expect to keep them doing what they do best during work and recreation. Okay, I think we've talked enough. I wanna see all this truck in action. Let's take a look at the all-new 2021 F-150. Here it is, the all new F-150. This thing has been redesigned from bumper to bumper. Every body panel is new. It has a tougher, more planet look, but the headlamps continue that recognizable C-clamp design. You'll know it's an F-150 when it comes at you, morning or night. And folks, this new F-150 features 11 grills across the lineup and 15 different wheels. But that's just the exterior. The interior is packed with features to boost your productivity. There are navigation and entertainment options, of course, but it's also packed with awesome features like the available Pro Trailer Backup Assist, which makes backing up a trailer as easy as turning a knob. It doesn't matter if you're towing a boat or a jet ski, you've got this. Plus, it's the first full-size pickup with standard over-the-air updates, meaning your all-new 2021 F-150 will stay up to date. And check out that interior. The available max recline seats give you a business class resting experience in the front. And there's an available work surface that folds out from the center console. And it's still built for it tough with a military grade aluminum alloy body and high strength steel frame. I could go on, but this is a SEMA show. So we wanna talk about gearing up and tricking out. I'll turn it over to you, Jared. Thanks, Kelly. For this build, we teamed up with the folks at BDS Suspension. Located in Coldwater, Michigan, BDS is owned by Fox Shocks, a Ford supplier partner. BDS has over 25 years of suspension experience and works with an established network of dealers across the country. BDS has a track record of delivering high quality SEMA builds. With me here 
is Carter Reed. Carter, how's it going? How's it going? I mean, this is a SEMA unlike any other, but SEMA is all about the aftermarket. And of course, we want to see your build. This is a dual purpose truck. So tell us about your masterpiece. Sure thing, Jared. So the F-150 is designed to be a tool that can help you get the job done. And this truck takes that even further. Well, the F-150 is available in both gas and diesel options. We opted for the new 3.5 liter Power Boost full hybrid, which unlocks so much potential for both work and recreational use. We also opted for the all new available Pro Power on board system. With Pro Power on board and because this truck is a hybrid, this truck packs 7.2 kilowatts of power, which blows the average truck's low draw 110 volt power inverter right out the water. While this truck has plenty of capability right off the lot, we took that capability to the next level with our four inch BDS lift system. This package includes Fox factory race series DSC coilovers and shocks able to soak up the roughest terrain. This lift provides enough clearance to fit larger 35 by 1250 Mickey Thompson Baja Boss tires on 20 by 10 Method 304 wheels. This setup offers improved performance as well as extra grip while increasing ground clearance and giving the truck a few extra styling points. Keeping with this dual purpose work and recreation theme, this truck has a ton of storage for carrying all of your gear. And this build, we took that to the next level. Up top, we went with a Yakima overhaul bed rack and accessory mounts. This gave us plenty of payload to stow gear up top and adds extra storage for storage packs, slim shady awning, and LED lighting. We opted for a few key lighting additions to complement the truck without going overboard. Up front, you'll find a Putco Illuminix Ford emblem on the grill, along with a set of rigid DSS series pod lights for trail visibility. In the back, we added rack lights for job and campsite visibility, along with some underbody LEDs that look great, but also come in handy if you ever drop a tool underneath the truck. That sounds pretty cool. So let's see what you and the team did. BDS as a whole has been in business for 25 years. We've got a ton of professionals that are really into customizing vehicles. On this project, we knew we wanted to work with the new F-150. We knew we wanted to work with the hybrid because that's something new, that's something cool, and something different. The objective with this build, it wasn't to go over the top. We really wanted to key in on what people use their truck for. They use it for work, they use it for play, they want to get out there and go on an adventure. We've been working with Ford for a number of years and it's really cool to work with a company that has the same mindset that you do to show what a vehicle can be and what custom features you can add to it. 2020 is one heck of a year and threw a ton of curveballs at us. Tight timeline for one, to get parts. Back orders and stuff like that, so actually Physically sourcing the parts was a challenge this year. The deck system is an awesome feature. I mean, it gives you a ton of payload up top and those storage drawers so you can pull them out and actually put stuff in there and it keeps them nice and dry. There was a lot of unknowns and worry and then at the same time, it all comes together. It's an awesome build that we can hang our hat on and be excited about. result of this truck is something really cool, really custom. This vision that we had at the beginning actually came together. This truck is right at home, whether it's for work, whether it's for play, whether you're hauling kids to soccer practice or doing your daily commute or whatever it ends up being, this truck is an accessible truck and ultimately it's, it's really designed for the person that wants to do it all. Welcome to our house on the lake, people. You can see it's still under construction, but thanks to this F-150, I'm sure it won't be long before it's completed. And check it out, Carter, the all new F-150 hybrid work and play with Pro Power on board. Carter, your gang did a really great job. So if you would, give us a tour of this uh, dream machine. Definitely, it's so cool to see this truck in action. So up front, um, you know, the truck has these awesome factory headlights, but we also tied in the Putco emblem, lights up. It's just a cool feature to accent the front of this truck. We wanted to tie in the satin throughout the truck because it has it on the, the emblems and stuff like that. So that ties into the front fascia, which ties into the front skid plate um, that we offered, as well as from there, it goes into the suspension. Yeah. So this is the BDS, this is the four inch lift system that we talked about earlier. It's got the Fox 2.5 series coilovers um, with the DSC adjustable reservoir. It's a cool trick feature to really dial in suspension how you need it. 
that allows clearance for these 35 inch Mickey Thompson Baja Boss tires on 20 by 10 uh, method wheels. You can't ignore just all the fun toys back here. You got the bicycle, you got the stand up paddleboard, even a little mount here on this Yakima rack system. What else do you have affixed here? We got everything from the Yakima rack that is adjustable so you can dial it in for whatever height you need. We have the awning, which gives you awesome shade coverage, or if it say it's raining, it yeah. keeps you out of the elements. Um, these rotopacks, it's a really cool feature. Most people know rotopacks, you see them on the Overland builds. They're used for fuel storage or water storage. These are actually a storage pack, so you can open them up and actually have a ton of storage inside for your gear, your tools, whatever you end up needing, it's, it's there for you. Again, congratulations to you and your team. Thank you so much for your time, Carter. Definitely. All right, to everybody out there, you're thinking that this special conversion is a one of a kind, right? Well, not true. Just scan the QR code that is now displaying at the bottom of the screen to see what went into this F-150 project build. You can also click on the link below. Want to hear even more about the build? Join us tomorrow for a deeper dive on this F-150 project build and all of the SEMA custom builds you've seen tonight. Register at the link below and you're gonna want to get a move on because space is limited. It's been great to hear how upfitting your F-150 can help you get the job done. But truck modifications can also be about style and speed and power. Trucks have been lifted, lowered, tuned, and tricked out for decades. So let's introduce you to two special guests who come from the more exotic side of truck customization. I am Haley Deegan and I am a NASCAR Ford Performance Development Driver. Hey, what's up, y'all? Jimmy Allen and I'm standing in front of my Ford F-150. The word truck means to me durability, toughness. From a young age, you know, I was like, man, my dream car is a Ford F-150. So when I'm not behind the wheel of a race car, I am either driving my dad's trimmer that he has, I am either driving my Mustang GT350, which I absolutely love. Everything I do, I like to find a way to make it my own, whether it's a truck, or whether it's my recording process, my songwriting process, my show. I love driving trucks because you just feel like so tough. It just shows kind of like a mean look, and that's what I like. <laughs> so we got the 22 inch Rockstar tires. I got a six inch lift kit on it. Whole truck's the blackout package. I think what makes the truck so distinct compared to any of the other vehicles in the NASCAR series, the aero in them is a lot more sensitive and they drive and handle, I feel like, a lot differently. So I have a lot of people in my life that are super special, but with my first F-150, there are two people I wanted to honor in this truck. In the yellow stitch, we got my son Aiden's name, and in the passenger side headrest, we have my grandma Betty's. And I was able to continue the family legacy with my grandfather and my father owning Ford F-150s. Now I got one. My son's gonna have one. There's guys that have been racing the truck series longer than I've been alive. And so it's really hard to be experienced like that, but it's gonna be a challenge and I'm excited for it. And we're out of here, built for tough. We wish Haley all the best on her rookie season. I want to go truck racing, and I want a truck like Jimmy's. I mean, maybe we could combine the two? Ah, who knows? Before we move on to the last part of our show, where we will be featuring the new Bronco, we have one more slice of Built Ford Tough to show you. Meet the all-new 2021 Ranger Trimmer Project Build, outfitted by Ford Vehicle's personalization team. This truck enables even the most adventurous of lifestyles. They use the all-new Ranger trimmer as a starting point to create the ideal mid-size overlanding rig. Now this thing is incredible, right? Right out of the factory, but there's a whole range of Ford accessories and Ford performance parts available, so you can customize it from rolling to the most remote trailheads to carrying a mountain bike, a kayak, and all the gear needed for a day of thrills and chills. The new Ranger Tremor off-road package includes new 17-inch magnetic painted alloy wheels, off-road tuned Fox 2.0 shocks, rear tow hooks, bigger tires, and auxiliary switches, just to name a few, which means you can accessorize like crazy. Folks, if you want to know more about this vehicle, just scan the QR code that is now displaying at the bottom of the screen. For those of you who want to grab some parts or accessories today, check out the link in the description for more details. If you can't scan the code, there's also a link below. Both will unlock this project vehicle for you so you can check out all of its features and maybe even make one for yourself. All right. Off we go in our final chapter. Strap in because we're about to get buck wild here on Ford Auto Nights SEMA Show Special. At the start of the evening, we met the Bronco Sport, which gets you to the adventure. Next up is its sibling, the Bronco, which is the adventure. Before we dive in, let's hear from a couple of Bronco enthusiasts 
why people are going so bananas for this vehicle.